Reagan National Airport looked much like it usually does. Airplanes taxing on the tarmac, travelers hustling to and fro, or just waiting. I'm going back to Minneapolis. I've been here since Monday. Almost everything is the same, except... Travelers at the airport didn't need these today when there is live music to enjoy. This is the first time I've heard music in an airport. It's a welcome change. I like it. I like this music, kind of music. It's rocks. Yeah. The music nowadays, the hip hop, I mean, it's cool, but I like jazz in the 70s. <laughs> I'm six, almost 60 years old. The Metropolitan Washington Airports Authority is celebrating Black History Month by featuring local African American artists for lunchtime concerts. Today's featured performer, Terry S. We need to know where we come from and where we are today, and people who've paved the way to give us the opportunity to do the things that we're doing today. So anytime I can be a part of something historical, it's, it's just an honor for me. A native of D.C., Terry has played at venues such as the Kennedy Center and the White House. Playing at the airport was a new experience. I never thought in a million years I'd be singing at an airport, but it's great. You know, it, 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 you can meet people from all over. And without her music, today could have been just like any other. I would be on my computer or making phone calls, so it's nice to hear some music. Another day traveling, but with music to soothe the weary traveler's spirits. At Reagan National Airport, I'm Jessica McLeod for CNS-TV.